Hello, student. Good morning. How are you today? I hope you're doing good. Perfect. Uh, this is Mr. Diego Armijos, and I'm going to be your English teacher. We're going to learn, we're going to play, and have a lot of fun. We're going to learn three different subjects, language art, science, and social studies. Uh, as you can see here, learning is fun. Yes, of course, we're going to learn watching videos, singing songs, and playing video games, okay? Perfect. As you can see here, This is Mr. Diego, and all of these were my students last year. As you can see, they are having a lot of fun. You see, they are very happy because it's the first time they are having virtual classes, okay? So right now I'm gonna teach you, I'm gonna explain to you how to use Zoom, okay? Let's get started here. The first thing that you have to do is download the Zoom app. This is the link, and then you click on the link and automatically download in your mobile device, okay? This you can download, download in your cell phone, your tablet, or if you prefer, in your computer. Perfect. Now let's continue. This is the crucial thing for you guys. How to use Zoom. So Mr. Diego, before starting his classes, Mr. Diego is going to send the invitation for you to participate in my class. Mr. Diego is going to be sending the link for you to join. This is the link. And the link I'll be sending you by WhatsApp or Gmail, okay? I think WhatsApp is much easier for you, okay? This link, and then when you, once you click on the link, you have to in, enter the meeting ID, and this is the password. Once you fill in all these, um, numbers and then you automatically are part of the meeting of my classes okay it's very important in online classes is very important that you students have to follow some classroom rules these are the most important classroom rules for example if you want to talk if you want to speak you have to raise your hand perfect and then the teacher can see you that you want to say something another important thing is that you have to listen you have to listen very carefully okay and most importantly you have to follow the teacher's instructions if the teacher says okay stand up thank you okay mute okay raise your hand etc you have to follow the teacher instructions that's very important now let's continue so in order to use zoom zoom has many features many tools to use we're going to start with the with this activity here you have an activity write the names of the color and then you're going to say teacher how can i do that i don't know how to do it that's right but you're going to learn today how to do it as you can see here there are the color and the boxes you see the color under the color you have small boxes that you need to write you need to complete what are you going to do first you're going to go right here as you can see here you have many options in the menu and then you're going to go here hey look carefully here annotate annotate can you see a pencil over here yes you're going to be here you're going to click on this i'm going to click you see and then automatically appears a what appears over here a toolbar with mouse select text draw stamp 
and many other options format you see many different colors and clear this is when you want to delete everything okay now we're going to start with text because we need to complete this we're going to click on text and hey, look click on text and what color is this blue perfect this is a color blue and then i want to write the name with a blue color and then you go here in the format you select the color look you select the color blue right here click on that and then you select the uh, put the core the cursor over here and click and then how do you spell blue excellent b l u e you see blue and that's all you see the name is there okay now what is then this color perfect this color is red you can move you see you can move the box okay we're going to start from here red okay text and then you go the formats here you have the color you choose the color red and then you write red okay the same thing here yellow perfect this is color yellow and then you start inserting the name of the color and then you continue doing the same thing for this remember you go to text when you click on that and then you go format to choose the color in order to write like this blue i wrote with blue ink red i, re I wrote with red ink okay perfect what have we used we used text and format now we're going to do another activity so before continuing the another activity we have to delete we have to clean this and then you're going to go here clear you see clear and clear all the drawings vamos a borrar todo lo que hicimos okay para hacer otra actividad clear all the drawings you click on that and automatically disappears okay and then you close the the menu right here click okay now we have another activity here in this activity the teacher asks you to draw draw what is draw you can draw and insert something how are you going to do as i tell you before as i told you before you go over here you go to annotate remember annotate go to annotate and we're going to draw here is text and here we're going to draw we're going to choose any of those options we're going to choose the first one let's suppose that mr diego asks you to draw uh, a ball let's draw a ball what color do you want to draw let's draw a color a ball color blue and then you select the format blue and then you can draw this is a ball okay another ball over here you see okay perfect now mr diego asks you to draw a a mouse let's draw a mouse color brown and then you're going to draw a mouse I'm not very good at drawing, but you could do better, okay? See? It's something like that, okay? <laughs> I'm not good at drawing, but you're going to do better drawings than me, okay? Perfect. And then Mr. Diego asks you to draw a sun. The sun is color yellow, perfect. And then you can draw the sun and then you can do this 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 etc you see and then in order to now we're going to do another activity you have to go right here clear all drawings in order to delete in order to er erase everything you go click and then everything disappears and then you close the options perfect now here we have another activity 
Here we have to match, we have to draw lines, match the words with the colors. This is very important, guys. And then you're going to have exercise like this in your classes. And then what are you going to do? You go right here, you see color green and red, you go right here, annotate, and draw. But what are you going to draw? You're going to draw an arrow because you're going to match. Let's choose, well, you can choose this one or this one. I'm going to use the third one, okay? And then you have here different objects with different colors. And here you have the name of the colors. We're going to start blue. Blue. Now we can choose the color as well if you want to do a, a beautiful job. You can color the, you can choose the color blue. And then you're going to click on the word and start dragging. You see, drag, 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 drag. There you go. Blue. Perfect. Now you're going to match the yellow. You go right here. The same thing. The arrow. You click on the word and then you, oh, you have to choose the format. You have to choose the format because it's color yellow. And then you're going to start doing this. Okay. But here, this is a mistake. You can... If you make a mistake, it's it's okay. And then you can go here. You can go here. You see this is a small arrow. You can go here and then delete too. We're going to try one more time. Draw. We're going to choose this one. We're going to color the form and the format is yellow and then you're going to match. You see the same thing with the red. Choose the color. You're going to match the red. And then that is the what is the next one? Green. Choose the color green and start matching. You see? And then you finish all the activities. OK. You see, it's it's not difficult. It's very easy, but it's a matter of practice. You have to practice, practice, practice. And that's what Mr. Diego is going to be doing. Mr. Diego is going to make you practice a lot in order to master this. In order to delete everything, you go right here, clear, clear all drawings, and it's done. Now we're going to do the next one, please. Oops, you need to you need to close. Don't forget to close this in order to continue the next one. Okay, you close. Oh, before starting, I want to show you this. Here next to annotator, you have the chat box. You hear you see here more. In more, you have the chat. You can click on the chat and then Mr. Diego can ask you, here Mr. Diego can write any question. For example, I'm going to write this. What, what is your favorite color? What is your favorite color? And then you have to use the chat to answer because we're going to be using the chat too. You can chat, but in English. And then you say, my favorite color is red. My favorite color is blue. And then we can use that, okay? Perfect. And then you close. Another option that I want to show you is this one. Here you can see uh, an icon that is a camera. If you click on this, the camera is going to turn it off. If you click on that again, the camera is going to turn it wrong. The same happened with this. Here you have the microphone. The microphone, if you click on that, nobody can hear you. But if you click again, you can start talking, okay? Okay, guys, that's all for today. I hope you learned a lot about this lesson and I hope to see you very soon. Thank you so much for your time and I hope to see you very soon, as I said. Thank you, guys. Have a nice day. Enjoy and stay home. Don't forget that. Stay home. Bye-bye.